have to do. At a public meeting in Five Rivers, Aruka, on Saturday night, the Prime Minister chastised the opposition for its spending from 2010 to 2015. He said money wasted then could have been put to use today. How much toilet paper could one million dollars buy? And if we had the millions that were taken by people from their own country, from their own party, couldn't we have had enough toilet paper so we could continue the meeting? And now that they've had to go home because they had no toilet paper. In response, the chairman of the Kuva Tabaki Talparo Regional Corporation, Henry Awong, said there was a toilet paper issue, but that's not all. Last week, Wednesday, at our personal committee, that we did the personal matters of the corporation, personal. We were informed by administration that there is no toilet paper in the corporation. The meeting was halted because we find that was, that was the proverbial show that grew the camel back. We have been having severe poverty, even producing our material to, to do normal everyday work, like patching potholes, like, like, like maintenance of vehicles. He said in some cases, councillors were threatened with eviction notices because they can't pay their rent. On a monthly basis, the CTTRC is getting money to pay wages and to pay the cost of living allowance. For the year, he said only $140 million was given to do work on roads and carry out other projects. But with 14 electoral districts, that is $10,000 each, which is not enough. And I'm wondering where is local government at all on the parity list of this government? Because those are the things that is needed to carry the everyday function of the corporation. Um, we can't even get that to, 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 to do, you know, we can't get the funding to do our everyday work. In the lead-up to the 2016 local government election, the PNM's campaign promise was local government reform. However, nothing tangible has been seen by the public since. There is expected to be a local government election later on this year. Rishi Harinanan, TTT News.